Hey everyone, Dan from Very Mediocre Gamers here, and this is the Swapper Part 6. We are... oh, hang on. No, 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 no. We are right where we left off, see? And we're still upside down, which is not fun. Oh, we saw that, didn't we, last time? Uh... Oh, mate. Chill the heck out. I flip and then... Okay, I, I, I'm not sure what these rooms are. We have 70 orbs, so we can actually progress the game uh, at least one way. But I'm going to see what these unexplored hatches lead to. More puzzle rooms. Yeah, that's one of those big orbs again. Whoa! I don't even see that there. Right. This is, this is the part where I edit a lot. Oh. Interesting. Let's see what we can do here. I don't understand why I don't even understand what I can try to do here. Okay, now I do. Um, there's the gap there that you can fire the swap array through. So I need to have someone stood there. But yeah, so I need someone like like there. Okay. Okay. Now what? How do I switch to him? There's a red light everywhere and there's no switch to turn them off. So what I need to do... Hang on. Is this just really easy? Just kill those. Put you there and then swap to you. Can I not create a clone? Why the hell not? Why can't I create a clone through there? I should be able to fire a swap right through. And... Hmm. Maybe it's not as simple as I thought. It's pretty simple. Put you there. Let's switch to you. Then put you there. Run all the way over here. Swap to you. And there we go. That was really easy. It just took a few seconds for me to figure out what to do. But comparatively speaking, very easy indeed. Okay, now we're in the room just above. I just cut the transit, there's no point in keeping it in, it's just boring. Memory terminal. Big orb. Big fancy orb. Yeah, I'll again, same as the other videos, I'll just leave this on the screen, but I'm not going to bother reading it. Okay, we have a box and a lot of red light. What the hell? Ah, another box. So push that over. I think I have this. So if we both jump on the box at the same time, and I can jump, swap, and then fall back down. Yeah. Again, really easy. Um, yeah, how the hell do I get down? There we go. And we go back to normal. And now we are in the room above. So far, so good. Very easy. Oh man, this looks a bit more complicated, doesn't it? It switches all over the place. Okie dokie then. I think I just figured out a solution, perhaps? Maybe? So we put you there. You there. We switch to you. Well, that opens the front door.
So if we put you there, or right on the edge, right on the edge, and then we cre create one more. Switch, and then... Okay, you can't climb through doors, and now I've just got a really bad feeling I'm stuck. Yeah, all I, all I can do is kill myself at this point, which is obviously not what I want. Squish. <laughs> what the hell am I doing? Hey, okay, now I'm gonna cut to here. Uh, I solved it. So what I had to do is get a guy up here on his own and then put one there so he flips up to there. Walk him right back, because obviously this guy walks back into a door, so this the, this one here doesn't move. Then I put a guy over there, so he's got a bit of space to walk back. And I put a guy there. So then I walk them back, but the guy who was up there was stood only here. So I can walk them back and then just eat him up. Hang on, two seconds. So, I lost my place a little bit. But yeah, because that guy had so much space to walk back, I could, I could walk him back. Uh, the guy I had up here, who obviously doesn't exist anymore, I could jump up and eat him. So that got rid of one of my clones. So then I can just teleport a guy there. And as you will see now, I have a clone able to do this. That took me seven minutes to solve. Oh, you should have been that was a pain in the ass. You should have been able to hatch the last panel by now. Hey, hey, shut up. Don't rush me, okay. I'll get there on my own time. Righty-o. How many orbs do I have? 97. How many do I need to go through there? Was it 99 or... You just don't want to tell me, huh? So 66 there. I can't see a number. Oh, hang on. It's right on the door. It's a bit hard to see. It says 93. I feel like I should go here. I also know there's a... Oh, God, sorry. My cursor here. I think I, like... I feel like I should go there because I know that there's a hidden terminal to get. I actually have a video open right now, so I'm just going to pull that up. And, uh... Ooh, look how warpy I am when I'm stood here. But whatever. Um, let's get this bitch open. Kinda looks like bones, doesn't it? Just me? I don't know. It looks like bones to me. It's kinda creepy. Right, okay, sorry. I am, um... I'm following a guide here. So, it looks like he's going straight up. Yep. Going straight up. Uh, there we go, to the right. Can you see that? I think I've messed it up a little bit. Um, there we go. Whoa, that is seriously hidden. Oh, I'm sorry. I was supposed to turn the notifications off so that a trophy unlock wouldn't happen all the time. I'm sorry about that. Uh, the next one is elsewhere. Not the place where Kashyyyk come from. Oh, Shit the bed! Catch him! That was bloody close, that. Where am I being sent to now? I don't want to go... I don't know where I want to go, actually. I have to detach panel. Oh. Oh, no. Wrong button. I meant to press circle to open the map. There's a lot of shit going on over there. Yep, okay. This is... Oh, ho, <laughs> ho. This feels very lonely. I can't hit my clones. I'm just going to push myself over. Okay. Oh, I don't like it. <laughs> it's so creepy. Like, reminds me of Event Horizon. When they're doing the, uh, the uh, am I even talking about the right film? I don't know if I am. It's just, ugh, I just switched to a clone and now I can't see because it's so dark. I don't have enough clones to switch to, so I have to keep firing and hope for the best. I don't think I'm talking about the right film with Event Horizon, by the way. You know what? It reminds me of. It reminds me of any space film. That'll do. Any space film where they actually make space look terrifying. I know. I'll go for gravity. It reminds me of gravity. Oh my god, come on. I can see my clones in the uh, the flashlight. 
Can you see them? They're so insignificant compared to the size of this shit. There we go. You know what I was doing? I was holding a left trigger down by accident, so that's why it was going so slow. Because obviously it goes in slow motion when you hold down L2. That was... that was very silly. Very silly indeed. I'm hoping these are just puzzle rooms. Why is it so fuzzy? Oh! I've just noticed how fuzzy it actually is. Look at a TV from the 80s playing some shitty VCR. VCR. I'm so glad that shit's over. Okay, does that mean I'm a clone down now? Here we go. Okay, so I figured it out. Basically, I didn't have enough clones to drop a guy over there once I had all the switches stood on, because there was one stuck there. But I noticed, if I run across here, and jump, then he would run across there, hit the switch, fall down, then I could make him jump over, and then I could eat him. So, that is no longer a problem. So now what we do, is we put a clone here, and then switch really fast. And then we start moving left. I'm going to do it in slow motion because it's a lot easier. Because we need to line up. Uh, because when he goes off the foot pedal, a purple light comes on. Oh, it's already there, actually. Right here. So I can only assume, I can only create a clone here. So I need to make sure they're lined up so they both step on the, uh, the foot switches at the same time. If I'm not explaining it very well, you'll see what I mean in a sec. There we go. I think that'll do. So if I put him there, like, because there's only, um... There's only a blue light here, so I can switch to him. Which I don't need to do, actually. What I need to do is just drop him there. There we go. That f that fucking took me so long. Dear lord. I've been working around for like ten minutes. I'm so glad that puzzle's over. Fuck this room. Now I've got to go back to the shitty VCR hub. Look at that. Fuzzy crap. Right. Uh, they, these challenge rooms are getting a lot tougher. Ugh, it's horrible. Just switch to you. <sighs> I am upside down, it appears. Oh, that's not a problem. Yep, another puzzle room. Okie dokie. What was that? Each word I concentrate, simplify. Make it, make them, ah, oh, fuck you. Okay, so no swapping allowed. You know what? I feel so burnt out after doing that puzzle. I'm not sure how many more puzzles I've got left in me. Oh, okay, I'm gonna leave that bit in. I don't know if you saw that, but I don't think I did this puzzle the right way. But, who the fuck cares? I think I just cheesed that. Wow. Okay, so if it wasn't clear, there's red lights all up in this bitch, so there was literally nothing. Just, you couldn't swap all. So I went upside down, put a guy right on the edge of that, and flipped around. And I basically just chased him, because there's a little... Pss this little lit up area wasn't red, so I chased him, and that bit there was red, and I just about managed to swap to him before he fell through the red. So I'm not sure if that's the way you're meant to do it or not, but that feel that felt a bit uh, cheeky. Hey, more puzzles with flippy upsy downsy stuff going on. That's fun. Okay. Put one there as I'm falling. I'm actually going to swap to him as well. Because, yeah, he dies from death. It's like edge of the purple light there. Okay. Um, so, what's the benefit of that exactly? Are there any more foot pedals? 
Okay, I'll, I'll explore the map a little bit. Yes, there is. There's one right there. I'm dead. I'm actually dead. It was a bit silly, wasn't it? Okay, so now what we're going to do is put a clone in this corner right there. We're going to switch, then we're going to slow down time. Yep, come on. Where's where's the thing? Come on. Put you there. Run you forward as much as possible. Put you there and swap. Okay, so. Question is can I cheese it? Oh, I, I cheesed it. I cheesed it right the way to victory. Fuck these puzzles. They are hard. Or I'm stupid. I'm willing to admit that it could be the uh, the lair. Thank God for memory terminals. I don't want to do that spacewalk again. It's cool as it was. You know what? You know what I'm gonna do right now? Dear Lord, there's so many places to go. I'm just gonna get the hidden terminal right here. Uh, this video, I've been recording for almost an hour, but I have no idea how uh, how long the actual edited version will be. So if it's short, I apologize, but I don't really have time to keep playing. I'm just going to get the last hidden terminal and whack this door open as well. Not the last hidden terminal. Oh. I the fuck? Not the last terminal I made, by the way. Um, Eight or nine? I don't know. Well, you know what? Whatever. Let's get this son of a bitch open. All I had to do was to attach these solar panels anyway. I'm pretty sure all these uh, puzzles I've been stuck on are just optional. Which is fine. I'm getting the most out of the game. And it is fun, as frustrating as it is. It's just so goddamn okay, difficult. We should be clear to land. We're waiting for you at command. We may I'm get waiting for me at command. Yet. Um, How you know what? I think this will be the ninth terminal, and there's only ten. So I must be getting close to the end of the game. Oh, by the way, I made a mistake. The uh, the hidden terminal is over here. What I need to do is fall. Whoops. Ah, oh, son of a goddamn bitch. Okay, I need to fall from like here. No! Yeah, we're good. Okay, so we're falling. Can't make any more clones, so hopefully he's dead. Not in a mean way. Alright, don't need to make any more yet. Oh, don't need to make any more yet. Don't need to make any more yet. All the way as high up as we can. And then switch. And then switch. And then... Really? Switch? Then... Oh. Man, I followed that video tutorial really haphazardly. But you know what? Look at that. We got number nine. And it's only ten. <sighs> yep. I don't know if you can tell by the tone of my voice, but I am just about done with this game for now. So, thank you very much for watching. If the video is short, I do apologize. It's hard to gauge how long it'll be when there's so much to edit out. But, hopefully, it will be fine. Uh, do all that YouTube crap if you like it, and I will see you next week.